Well, 10 years ago, we got a homecoming of sorts for a reality TV star. J.R. Martinez was in the middle of his winning run on Dancing with the Stars. He went to high school in Dalton and had returned to speak at Southern University. But his message to students wasn't about his show or his soap opera career. Martinez told him about a landmine in Iraq that changed his life. Been all glitz and glamour for Dalton native J.R. Martinez. Let's rewind to April 5th, 2003, when this then Humvee driver for the United States Army ran over a landmine. They say I was trapped inside the truck for about 10 minutes, and the whole 10 minutes I was completely conscious, thinking my life was going to end. Inhaling smoke literally burned him from the inside out. 33 surgeries later, he didn't just get a new face, he got a whole new perspective. I look at it as a glorious day. I look at the old JR, you know, that died and, and a new person was born and it is who I am today. From a mess to a message. I think too often that we get derailed when, when the tracks become curvy instead of, you know, understanding that once we get past the curves part, it's a straightaway. And so we have to remember that and we have to keep mind of that. And if we do that, things will get better. Young and old, it's a message you can see from the looks on their faces hits home. It really inspired me to know that no matter what you go through, there's always a bright side and whatever you take away from the negative and turn it into a positive, you can just really make your life a whole lot better. Like he said, just do it. Don't think about it, just do it. And with that smile, you know he's sincere in his message. When it's your turn to stand up, <laughs> do it. In Hamilton County, Alicia Searle, WDF News 12. So what has JR been up to since 2011? Well, he's still on the road as a motivational speaker. He's continued his acting and now hosts both a radio show and a podcast. But this is what's really keeping him busy these days. His second child, Leo Daniel Jones Martinez, was born just last month. Congratulations. 